Um, I'd also like to take a moment while I have you to recognize some of the people that actually make D23 happen. Um, obviously, from the, uh, uh, the uh, film that we showed you at the beginning, Bob Iger has been a huge supporter of D23. It's actually his idea to kind of start looking at ways that we can you know, create some sort of a fan club. And then my team came in and came up with some ideas that we ran by him. And, and we ended up with D23. Uh, but another person that uh, doesn't get you know, sort of any recognition for a uh, role she played is actually this lovely lady right here, Zendi Muka. She uh, is my boss. She uh, runs uh, communications for the Walt Disney Company. And uh, she has been such a huge proponent and champion of, of D23 and getting uh, all the right approvals. That if you ever see this, uh, uh, is anyone at any events or the next expo? Um, you know, definitely, you know, stop her. And uh, I noticed this during rehearsal today. For the first time, our cart was number 23. <laughs> but neither of us are Barry, so I don't know. We'll get to Barry in a minute. So, <laughs> thank this you. is Becky Fly. So we do know Becky. Uh, so you also know. Yeah, big round of applause for Becky. I've been called my son the father of D23. I think there are many fathers and mothers of D23. So no one person can take credit for it. But Becky is the fairy godmother of D23 for sure. In fact, that's the one I And now you get there in a minute. And I think it was very well deserved. And uh, we use it often, or rather she does. So, Becky, I hope you don't hate me for uh, showing this photo. Uh, I thought it was. Okay, Joanna Spratt is right there. This photo is taken in Magic and Arrow. As some of you may recall, or maybe you didn't see, the little fight she had with Stitch over the gingerbread house. Joanna has since been disciplined, and it will never happen again. But uh, Joanna uh, has been a huge uh, key to be with success, so uh, you should have stopped by and say hi to her if you get a chance. Matthew Kareem Puglia uh, is kind of nice. being one of the, uh, I mean, go-to guys for the D23 Expo. Yeah. I mean, he made that thing happen, uh, and uh, you know, we couldn't do all these special events without Matt and all his energy and enthusiasm. Then there is Barry Jacobson. Yeah. Mr. Jacobson. Barry, he uh, the is all Mayor of Expo, uh, was the general manager of the D23 Expo, and also heads up all of our special events, especially here on the East Coast of World Disney World. And, uh, you know, if you know Barry and have ever walked through not only a Walt Disney World resort part or park with Barry or let alone Disneyland, you can't walk five feet without, hey, Barry, hey, hi, hi. This man is the most popular man at Walt Disney World, and uh, he's earned that reputation because the guy gets the job done. And it, for those of you who went to the 23 Expo, I think, uh, you know, it is now a family event. And, you know, Barry, Obviously taken, but I think it was two days before the expo opened, so wow. you know we transformed that place uh, uh, you know, pretty quickly. So uh, next I have to wait for you. I'm going to show you something that we cannot afford. So.